Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid so guys, I'm making some sorrel right here and in my pot I have cinnamon sticks, I have pimento berries and I have ginger, the most special ingredients and I have some bay leaves because I don't have cinnamon leaves so that's what is in the pot going on right now and I'm going to be placing my sorrel in sorrel doesn't take long to make, it's very easy, very very easy so this is what I have in the pot now, ginger pimento berries cinnamon sticks and bay leaf you can make your sin um your sorrel your way this is how i am making it yes so the ginger is the very most important and the cinnamon and the spices so i'm just going to be putting my sorrel and it's not going to take long to 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 draw so this is my sorrel and i'm going to be placing the sorrel into the pot i washed it already so i'm just going to be placing that into the mixture and it's going to be staying there and um yeah and the rest is going to just draw nicely and we're just going to be cooking that up yeah so that is going to be draw very nicely and you just cover the pot and the next day you can pour it out yeah very easy Guys, look at the sorrel. It's so rich. It's very rich. I like this drink. It's very nice. So you can put rum or wine, whatever you want to put on it. Yeah, so I turn off the stove. And I'm just going to cover it up and let it, um, it stay there and fermented and makes it nice little um juices and just just marinate nicely i'm gonna turn off the stove now all right um so guys here is my cereal the next day and i'm going to be straining off my cereal and i have um rum right here and i have red label yeah, so this is what i'm going to be putting in the cereal yes so you don't have to use rum if you don't want you just can use the red label whatever whatever is your choice yeah so i'm going to be straining this off and um you see how lovely color it has yes it is nicely fermented and everything i go on nice and you can smell the aroma of the the ginger and the uh, um the cinnamon and everything that I put in it it just smells so good and ready to be ready to drink all right yes so guys I'm just gonna be squeezing this squeeze out all the cereal make sure we get everything out Guys, you see that nice and red. So I'm just gonna squeeze out everything to get everything. So guys, I'm gonna be putting some sugar for sweetener in the sorrel, and this is like a little bowl. And if you want more, you can always add more sugar. Yeah, so this is what I'm gonna be placing. And it's brown sugar that I'm using. I'm gonna be placing some some of this wine, red label wine. That a little bit, and that's a little bit of rum. It's optional if you don't want, but I'm just using a little, little bit. So this rum is very strong. If they want more, they can always add more. And I'm gonna be stirring with my wooden spoon. Yeah, and it smells real good. guys i'm gonna be pouring my sorrel and here over ice Ooh. you see that rich yeah and that's the moyes way christmas sorrel yeah so have a merry christmas and a happy new year's 
and lots of blessing from the Moyes Bay family. So I'm going to be drinking to you guys. Cheers. Merry Christmas.